Judy Garland said it well Never be a second-rate version of somebody else You got your own two wings and you can choose to fly or fall Got a three-room apartment in a run-down part of town There's a dream I'm chasing, don't tell me to slow down Everybody's so quick with advice about Hey guys, we just got done with our first London gig. Very exciting at the Half Moon Putney. It was a fun show. Mm -hmm. Belinda, what was your favorite moment tonight? Um, seeing you play Genesis. Mm -hmm. That's my favorite moment. We're all a bit, actually. <laughs> Yes. That was a good one. I like the jealous, but I like your speech about being a musician afterwards, and I got a little choked up on the stage. My favorite is that this tea kettle is super loud right now, and I didn't even think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Hey friends, we just got to Liverpool. We're very excited. We're a little sleepy, but very excited. Just so that everybody knows, Porsche. he got his own room tonight. Oh my goodness. <laughs> he got the good room. Never. I offer it to anyone <laughs> He got the good room while Belinda and I have to share a room with the tea kettle <laughs> and, the, and the bathroom. I'm having a party here. It's just, it's, I just don't know. I don't know. We are getting ready to drive to London. We just finished our gig in Liverpool. It was awesome. It was so much fun. We got to do an encore, which was a huge blessing. And Jeff is about to experience a UK energy drink for the first time. Lucas Aid, the only aid for Liverpool to London post gig driving. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff is currently trying to crawl into his bed. <laughs> it sounds like it's really comfortable too. <laughs> we are in Manchester. <laughs> he really is. Jeff needs to hold the ceiling up. <laughs> and um, Belinda and I have our little bunk bed. I, I wish I could scoot back a little bit to show you the whole room, but I just can't. I just, I can't get in. All um, I know is if I come <laughs> off of this sucker tonight, y'all are in big trouble. It's gonna hurt really bad. Belinda, tell us a little bit about the bathroom. Well, I'm going to use it in a second, but I reckon that I could use the toilet sink and the shower at the same time. <laughs> it's like a free one. Don't want to see the world alone. Let's get ahead of ourselves. Let's get ahead of ourselves. 
practicing our best English accents, and Belinda has taught us a little, little riddle rhyme to help us work it out. Here we go. Betty Potter bought some butter, but she said this butter's bitter. If I put it in my batter, it would make my batter bitter. <laughs> She's the Minnesota girl who moved to Nashville and has been writing um, across uh, the winning fans across the world with her powerful voice and beautiful songwriting. I hear a little birdie tells me that you, you were once a fan of the Spice Girls. I was. I absolutely <laughs> was. I remember singing their songs into my hairbrush in front of the mirror <laughs> when I was a kid, so they're definitely great. I wish that he could hold me. How are you feeling, Sammy? I'm feeling good, but a little bit tired. Just had to lug my smelly old amp, which weighs 10,000 kilotons, for like 100 miles from the car park to come and play with Emma Stevens to support Jen Bostic, but it's worth it. It's a long way to the top if you want to rock and roll. <laughs> We're gonna go find some Irish music to jig to. It's gonna be good stuff. Listen to me, listen to me. I wish there were two sets of shoes by the door. I wish his dirty jeans were in the middle of the floor. I wish that I could blame him for the dishes left to do. But most of all, I wish he knew. supposed to drive down this road <laughs> but here we are this is a super exciting moment we're just driving in Belfast and let's get ahead of ourselves came on the radio really very exciting 